Welcome back, we're Garden NBC. Today, I'm gonna tell you how to grow some amazing beans like these. Okay, so first of all, in the springtime, you wanna start off with picking the right varieties. I like some burgundy beans, the yellow beans, and the green string beans. Now, pick uh, different varieties with different lengths of uh, duration to maturation. If you look on the seed package, it'll tell you like 60, 90, 120 days. Pick a variety because you don't want all your beans getting ready at one time because you see it happens kind of already at the same time anyways, even they do have maturation. But if you spread them out, they'll, you'll get beans off a little bit earlier and then they last a little bit longer. And you'll see, depending on the variety, it kind of stretches things out. So once you got the beans, till your soil, get it ready, do whatever you have to. And then plant those beans about oh half an inch to one inch deep. Once your beans come up, they're gonna look like that. I just planted these the other week and they're already coming up really nicely. Now that's my second crop. Here's my first crop. I'm already picking my beans off these ones. See here's some small beans. I already picked the larger beans off. Let's look underneath. Here's some larger burgundy beans. And uh, you want to come around when your beans are starting to get ready and check because you might check and your beans will be all big and hard and you won't want to eat them like that. So check, uh, you know, every few days once the plants get big like this, you'll notice they start sending out blossoms and then pretty soon once they start, ha once they start having the little tiny beans, they grow really fast. In a few days you'll have big beans like this. So this is an easy way to pick them. You don't want to break the stems because they keep growing and sending out more blossoms like that and they'll keep making more flowers. So just grab the bean and kind of twist it. And you push backwards and it uh, comes off like that. I kind of just pinch them off. But if you twist it, it comes off really easy, just like that. So that's what I do. And uh, when you're picking beans, pick as many as you can because it actually helps the plant produce more. They'll take the take the bigger beans off that take most of the energy from the plant and uh, so pick them even if they're on the smaller side uh, once you think they're large enough for you to eat just go for it and then if you want to let these go uh, to get actual beans out of them just let them grow and grow and dry out they'll dry out let them dry out on the plant and the pod will actually harden and turn brown and then once they're dry like that pick them off and put them in a bowl, the pods will crack and you'll have your hard dried beans. You can save them for seed to use for the next year. They will definitely grow. Or you can eat them like you would any other hard, hard dried bean. So keep these tips in mind when you're growing beans next year. And I hope you have good luck. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching guys.